have something to come on here and say. You know, the enemy has been attacking me so, so, so bad. But let me tell you, it's not my fight physically. It's not my fight physically. It's a war that I'm in right now. And see, God is elevating me to another level. Why? Because that level, I understand that first level. So the next level, he's going to take me to. And the next level he's going to take me to, going to have me going against more demon spirits. Guess what? You know what they say? New levels, new devils. New levels, new devils. That's what it is. New levels, new devils. More demonic spirits. And you know what's crazy? I come to realize I'm fighting hard. I'm fighting so bad. I'm under an attack so bad. I'm warring with people at my school right now so bad. It's drama that's been constantly going, constantly going, constantly going. And when the enemy sees you alone to yourself, He's trying to get you out of that, out of yourself. He's trying to get you out of your, hmm. He's trying to get you out of your spirit. He's trying to get you out the spirit of lightness and come to the dark and have you fighting against with these people, fighting them physically. You know what I'm saying? He wants you to fight them physically. But guess no, but I'm going to continue to say to myself. Because I'm not going to give him what he won't. It's not even my battle. I know who battles it is. It's Jesus Christ's battle. It's not my battle. He might put the battle on me. You know why he put the battle on me? Because he want me to see the battle. He want me to see the battle. But he's fighting the battle. I understand. He wants me to see the battle. But I'm not fighting the battle. He want me to see the battle. But I'm not fighting the battle. And you know what's crazy, y'all? You're not going to understand until you take off the blindfold. You are, you, 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 you how can I explain it? You're not going to understand until you take the blindfolds off. You're, you're at a wall right now. You're, you have a wall in front of you. You're trying to see. You're trying to see what's on the other side of that wall, but you can't because you still have this. You still have this. You can't see. You can't see because you have this. You have a wall. You have a wall like this. There's a wall. Just like a wall, just like you have walls in the room. You can't see what's next, what's behind that wall until, until that wall opens up. Until you really get to see what's behind that wall. And and, and it's so and that's what people don't realize. And that's what and that's what people is not understanding. That's what people don't understand. That's what they don't understand is that they have a wall in front of them and they're trying to knock down that wall in front of them, but they can't knock it down until they realize, until they understand. Jesus Christ, my goodness, my, my goodness. You're not going to understand and take, until you take the blindfolds off. You're like this. You, you, you're like this. You're like this. You can't even see me. You can't see me. Because I'm blocked. I'm blocked off. You have something blocking you to where you can't see. You have stuff blocking you. You can't see. You're, 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 blo you're blocked. You can't see what's on the other side of that wall because you're blocked. You don't understand. You don't know. You're blocked. You can't see nothing. 
You're blinded. You can't you, you can't see on a spiritual room, but you can't see. You can't see. You can't see what's behind that wall for you. You might have you <laughs> this is good. You might have something that you really want. It can be a house, a car, it can be anything you want. It could be anything you pray for, you ask for. But until then you take that blindfold off, until then you break that wall, you're not going to get it. You're not going to get it. it. You know what's crazy? It's behind that wall. It's behind the wall. It's behind the wall. You have a wall in front of your face. But you're not going to get that car, that house, anything you want until you break that wall, until you take take off the blindfolds, until you break that wall. This is this is good. This is things this is really good. Now let me now let me revert it back to the world. You're not going to get what you want unless you really you're not gonna get what you want until you do what you need to do to get it you might want something but you gotta earn you gotta earn it to get it you gotta earn it to get it and that's what people, a lot of people don't understand you got to earn it to get it. You got to earn it to get it. You want a car. Earn it to get it. You want a house. Earn it to get it. You want a phone. Earn it to get it. You want shoes. Earn it to get it. You need to charge it for your phone. Earn it to get it. You want to do you want to do videos, a YouTube video. Earn it to do videos. You need a camera to do your videos. Earn that camera to get that camera. You need a job. Find a way to try to get that job. You got to earn it to get it. That's the message today. Earn it to get it. Earn it to get it. But let me tell y'all what I'm dealing with, okay? I'm dealing with a lot of people in the school right now. I have people that's attacking me in the school right now and it's getting to me right now in the school. But let me tell you what it is. It's not them that I'm fighting with but i'm fighting their spirits the demon devil spirit that's in in every last one of them that's what i'm dealing with and you know what's crazy all of a sudden i stopped talking to them and now it's a problem But because God has allowed me to see who y'all really is to me, now the same y'all attacking me. You know what's crazy? I was so blinded. I was so blinded. I didn't know. I didn't understand, y'all. I didn't understand. I didn't know that y'all was stabbing me in my back the whole entire time. The whole entire time I was talking to y'all. Not knowing that y'all been stabbing my back a long time ago. Y'all already stabbed me in my back a long time ago. Y'all already stabbed me in the back already. But I didn't understand it. I was like this. I had a wall that I couldn't see. I had a wall right here. I just had a wall. Just, just like I'm looking at this wall right here. Just like I'm looking at this wall right here. I had a wall. But I broke that wall. 
I broke it. I broke that wall. And now I see what's on the other side of that wall. I seen who they really was on the other side of that wall. Me thinking that is that these people are really my cool friends, they're my close friends, they're gonna rock with me forever. They're gonna always have my back forever. But really stabbed me in my back on the other side of that wall. I didn't know. I didn't know. I did not know. I had, I was this, this. I didn't know. And that's what's going on in the world today. You don't know. This is what's going on in the world today. You don't understand because you have a wall. You have a wall that's blocking you. And you're trying to see what's behind that wall. But you're not going to be able to see. If you don't break the wall. You got to break that wall. You got to break it. And you know what's crazy? My whole entire family right now is on an attack. It's, it's, it's on an attack. But God is not... It's, we're on an attack right now. But we're also in a war. But let me tell you, God is not going to put... He's not going to allow you to go through a war if Satan already got you pulled in. God is only going to give the wars to people. God is only going to give the wars to people that can handle it. Handle it. He's only going to give the wars to the people that can handle it. Handle it. But if you can't handle that war that he's putting you in, you're going to fail that war. And you know what's crazy now that I'm realizing? That war is going to continue to keep happening. It's going to continue and 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 continue until you get it. You fail that war, you're going to keep going. You're just going to continue to keep going through that exact same war. Until you understand how to handle that war. And it's like me. I'm going to elevate to a new level. Because I understood that first level. And now I'm going to go to the next level. And guess what? And now I'm going to be fighting new devils. <laughs> Ain't that crazy? Ain't that crazy? God is looking for the ones that can handle it. He's not going to put it on you if you cannot handle it. And if you already pulled in with Satan, if you, if you have that life right now where you're just living life and you free, Satan already got you in it. You don't even know it. Satan already has you in and you do not already know it. Why? Because you're living life. Right now you you ain't you, you're not trying to get to the next level. You still on that first level. You're still on that first level. Satan, Satan still got you on that first level. And you're gonna continue to be on that same level, that, that exact same level, until you come in. Until you understand. Until you understand that level that you're on. You can't go to another level until you understand that level that you was on. Just like how you was in school. You can't go to the next grade until you understand that grade that you're in now. I can't go to the 10th grade until I understand the 9th grade assignments. Spiritually. I can't go on the next level spiritually if I don't understand the level that I'm on. You got to understand. You got to know. You got to take off the blindfolds. Take it off. Open up your eyes. Open up. Open them up. You have them closed. Your eyes are closed. You can't see. 
Your eyes are shut. You can't see. Spiritually. Physically, you can see. Spiritually, you're blinded. You can't see nothing. You can't see at all. You, you, you can't see anything. And let me tell you. <sighs> so, anyways... So now the sudden these people, so I stopped talking to them, right? I stopped talking to them. You know why? Because God allowed me to see that wall what was on the other side of that wall. What was on the other side of them. That side that they gave me might look the good, but the real them was, I got to see who they really was. They backstab me. They, they backstabbers. They backstab me. They backstab me. Mm hmm They backstab me. And if that and if you know what's crazy? And if that's what God wanted me to see, that these people have been backstabbed you a long time ago, but you just don't understand because you had you had a wall. You had a wall that you couldn't look. You were just looking at that wall. You couldn't break that wall. You were just looking at the wall. Your eyes were closed. You were in darkness. Your eyes were closed. You couldn't see. You were blind. You couldn't see. But as soon as I started being to myself, as soon as I started talking to everybody, I just need, I just, all I needed, you know what's crazy, y'all? All I needed was a break. I just needed some alone time. I just needed a break. And then I was going to start talking back to them. I can't even take a break and be alone for a couple months or a couple days without them reacting I have a problem with them. That's how I know that y'all all had backstabbed me. I just needed a break from y'all. I just needed a break from y'all. And y'all all backstabbed me just because I wanted a break to myself. And if, if that's what God wanted me to see, that these people already had backstabbed me a long time ago, that's what I have seen. That's what I have seen. I've seen it already. I've seen it. I have seen what God wanted me to see. Mission complete. I've I, I seen that already. I have seen it. And now that I have seen that side of them, now I pulled back. Now they're mad. Now they're mad. Now they're mad. I stopped talking to them because I seen who y'all really was. Now you're mad. That devil demon inside of them is mad because why? Why? The, why that demon devil is mad? Because I seen it. The enemy didn't want me to see that demon devil in them. It's not them. It's that demon devil inside of them that I now have seen that got them acting like that. That got them stabbed me in the back. And I have came to realize that's what it was. And now we don't connect no more. You know why we don't connect no more? Because that demon double inside of them cannot connect with the light inside of me. Why? Because darkness and light does not mix. Let me tell you something. If a person can connect, if you can connect with a person so easily let me tell you why you can connect with them so easily because you and that person got the exact same spirit the exact same spirit but if if i can't connect with you that's because that darkness in you can't connect with the light inside of me let me say that again if i cannot connect with you that means that demon is double side of you 
cannot connect with me. Vice versa. If I have that demon devil inside of me and you have light in you, it's not going to connect. You know why? Because light and darkness does not mix. It does not mix. No, it doesn't mix. So we're going to bump heads. We're going to have problems with each other because light and darkness does not mix. Understand that when you say you don't like a person or you hate a person, you don't hate them. You hate that demon devil inside of them. And it can't mix with the light inside of you. When people say they hate them or hate somebody, you're saying, let me tell you what you're saying. You're not saying that you hate that person. You're saying that you hate that demon devil spirit inside of them. That demon spirit inside of them is what you're saying that you hate, that you don't like. You don't like her. Oh, I don't like her or I don't like him. Let me tell you why you don't like him. Because that demon devil inside of them cannot mix with the light inside of you. And if you and if they have light in them, that demon devil inside of you not going to mix with them. It's not that you're saying that you hate them. It's not that you're saying that you hate them. You're saying that you don't like that spirit in them. Why? Because that dark spirit and you have light is not going to mix. So it's going to have y'all bumping heads. And I was dealing with, I was dealing with every last dark spirit and every last person. They all have dark spirits. And I'm fighting against every last dark spirit in them. But what they don't understand is you, 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 you cannot connect with Nyla. You cannot connect with Nyla. With Shanila Latrice Butler. You cannot connect with her until you. Until that demon devil spirit leave you. Then you could connect with me. Because now. Now what? You have light in you. And light and light mix. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? It's not you saying that you hate that person. It's you saying that you don't like that demon devil spirit that they're dealing with. Because they have darkness and you have light. So y'all gonna bump heads. This is good. This this is really good. This is this is why I'm under an attack. This is why. This is why I'm in war. This is why. Because first of all, I can handle the war. I can handle it. God has seen what I need to see. And now I'm elevating to another level. Now I'm elevating to another level. You know what the Bible says? The Bible says we don't wrestle against flesh and blood, but against spirits and principalities. Let me say that one more time. We don't wrestle against, against flesh and blood, but against y'all's spirits and principalities. We're fighting that spirit that you have on you. That's what we're fighting. We're not fighting you physically. We're fighting that spirit that's on you. You got to listen to the word. You got to relate it back to the world. We against not. We wrestle. We, 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 we don't wrestle against flesh. Flesh. Our, our, us. Us physically. Me, how I look today, we don't wrestle against that. We wrestle against the spirits that we have on us. 
when somebody kills somebody, that's a spirit. That's a that's a spirit that they have on them, in them. That had them to kill that person. Why? You know why the person killed that person? Because that darkness in them didn't have no future. So if that darkness don't have a future, guess what? It's gonna wanna kill it. What you what which what, what the spirit realized, what your your spirit realized that you do have a future. But that demon devil spirit inside of you don't have a future. Why? Because it's of darkness. It's not light. So anything of darkness, it's going to try to kill you and try to destroy you. It says it in the Bible. If you could just take your Bible and open it up and read it, things will come. Things will begin easier and easier and easier and easier. And you're going to open up because right now you're like this. But it's going to open up like this. Slowly. 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 It's going to begin to open up your eyes slowly more, more, and more. But you just got to want to break that wall. You gotta wanna break that door down. You gotta wanna break that door. You gotta wanna break that wall. Cause you gotta continue to see, keep seeing that same wall until you break it all the way. And when you break it all the way, you can get to the next wall. And when you break that wall down, you can get to the next wall. And when you break that wall down, you can get to the next wall. And when you break that next wall down, you can get to the next wall. Until you get your blessing. Until you get your miracle. Until you get what you need. You All you got to do is keep knocking these walls down. That's all you got to keep doing. Keep knocking them down. Keep knocking them. Keep knocking them down. Just keep knocking them down. Because when you knock them down, you're going to keep elevating to the next level. Next level. Next level. Next level. And next level. And next level. But let me tell you, new levels, new doubles. If, if you, say if you was at a high, high level, you was on a way high level. You're on that high level, but you want to make it to the, high, the next higher level. It don't matter if you're down here or if you're up here. It don't even matter. But if you're not going to understand your level... You're not going to get to the next one. You have to understand the level that you're on in order for you to get to the next one. That's just like you're at school. You're not going to pass that grade until you understand the grade that you're in. Like I said, I can't go to the, the, the 10th grade if I don't understand the work that I have going on in ninth. That's what it is. You just got to keep knocking that wall down. Keep knocking it down. Because when you keep knocking it down, you're getting somewhere. But let me tell you. It's not the person you're saying that you're hating. Understand this, y'all. It's not the person. It's that spirit in them. What people don't understand is they think that they're just saying, oh, I hate you. I don't like you. I hate you. When you say that, you're saying that spirit in you, I don't like. That's what you're saying. I don't like that spirit in you. It got to go. It needs to leave. I don't like it. It can't stay there. It can't stay. I don't like what you're dealing with. Whatever you're dealing with, you're trying to put it off on me. And I don't like it. And we're not going to be able to be cool with each other. We're not going to be able to be friends until it leaves you. Until you decide to break that spirit inside of you so that me and you can be cool. And so me and you can be friends. When you want to fight a person, you don't want to fight them physically. You want to fight them spiritually. 
You're fighting their spirit. You're not fighting them. You're not fighting their flesh and blood, but you're fighting their spirit and you don't even know it. When somebody says they hate me, they're saying that they hate, that what, the, what they're saying is they hate that light inside of me. That's what they're saying. They're saying that they hate that light inside of me. They want to destroy my lightness. But you know what I'm you know what I'm trying to do? I'm trying to break that darkness in you. That's what I'm trying to break. I'm trying to break that darkness in you so you can come to the light. So me and you can become friends. But we can't become friends until you break that darkness. Right now, the world is dark. We are we are in darkness. We are in darkness, y'all. We are in darkness. Y'all can't, we can't see. Y'all can't see. Y'all can't see. Y'all in the dark. Y'all can't see what y'all doing. Y'all don't understand what y'all doing. Y'all in the dark. But I promise y'all, when y'all open up y'all eyes, the light will come on. But right now, we are all in darkness. When I, when I mean darkness, killing each other, Stealing, robbing, gangs, all all this stuff. Smoking, drugs. All that is a demon. That is a demon that's trying to destroy you. And you don't even realize it. That's darkness. We in so much darkness right now. And so people understand that this stuff is darkness. The light's not going to come on. You can't see. You're in darkness. You, you can't see. You're in darkness. You can't see anything. You're dark. You can't see nothing. You're in darkness. You can't. You, you just. You just can't see. You can't see nothing you're doing. You don't know what you're doing. Why? Because the enemy has your mind. He has your mind. He has your soul. He pulled you in already. So what now? He's not worrying about you. You're fine. You're living life. Because he has pulled you in already. You're living life. You're living life. You're done. You have been pulled in with the enemy, so you're good. You can live life now. You can go do what you want to do. You can go smoke, drink, have fun, party, twerk, all that. You, you can do all that because he got you in. He got you in. He got you in hell with him, with his demons now. He pulled you in at this point. So why? You're not going through nothing. You're good. You're having a good time. But the ones that are going through something right now that's going through a battle that's under attack right now is getting ready to go to the next level god's gonna show them that first level so they can get to the second level but when you get to the second level you're gonna have new devils you're gonna have new demon demonic spirits that you're gonna be dealing with i'm telling y'all i'm telling y'all it's not us. It's the spirits in these people. You gotta understand. If you understand these spirits in these people is what got them acting like, acting like this, you can go to the next level. You can't move on to the next level until you understand the level that you're on. That's what it's about. The light is not gonna come on in this world until everybody takes off the blindfold. Until you break that wall. Like I said, you got to break that wall and keep breaking walls to get what you need. You got to keep breaking that darkness until you get to the light. You got to keep going. You can't stop it. You can't stop. Because when you stop, guess what? The enemy has now got you. And let me even tell you something. Being gay... That is not of God. That is not of God. That's that demon devil inside of them that got them acting like that. 
And what they don't realize is, it's that demon devil and spirit in them that got them acting like that and don't even know it. It's a spirit in them that they don't even know what they're dealing with. Why? They're not going to understand. You know why they're not going to understand? It's because they're in the dark. They are in the dark. And the people that think it's okay and uh, is allowing it is in the dark. You're in the dark. When you allow people to be gay and be bisexual, that is darkness. You are in darkness. You are in darkness. And you're not going to understand. And you're not going to know until you break that wall. You got to break the wall. You got to break it all the way. You can't break it halfly. And you can't and you can't break it suddenly. You gotta break it all the way. Break it till it's fully broken. So you can get to the next wall. Into the next wall. Into the next wall. Into the next wall. You gotta understand. The reason why we're going through so much today, y'all, is because it started with Adam and Eve. Cain and Abel. If she didn't realize that spirit in her, if she didn't, if she would have realized that that spirit in her had her being rebellious when she, when God told her not to eat from that tree, but because that demon devil spirit that was inside of her had her eat from that tree, and this is why we're going through so much today. This is why women go through so much today. Because it all started in the Bible. You got the Old Testament and the New Testament. We are now in the New Testament. The Old Testament has already happened. We're now in the New Testament. The New Testament has to be fulfilled. The Old Testament is already fulfilled. We're now in the New Testament. The world is coming to an end. And the enemy knows he has a short time. But the enemy is trying to pull me in. But I guarantee you, he's not going to pull me in. He's not going to pull me in. He can't pull me in. Because my eyes are open. My eyes are not closed. My eyes are open. So I recognize, I recognize, I recognize the demon devil spirits that I'm dealing with. I recognize it. When you don't recognize it. You don't know. You don't know. But you're going to continue to keep fighting with these exact same spirits until you understand what it is. You got to understand what it is. You got to. You got to understand what it is that these people are dealing with. You're not saying that you hate them. You're saying that you hate that spirit in them. Right now we're in darkness, but we can't come, the light's not going to come on until y'all come out to our darkness. Light and darkness does not mix. You can't connect with a person if they have darkness in them. Understand that. When you say when you say you hate your mom, you're saying that you hate whatever is inside of her that got her acting like that towards you. That's what you're saying. You're not saying that you hate your mother physically, but you're saying you hate that spirit inside of her. And if it's always causing y'all to beef, let me tell you why. Because that demon's devil inside of her is reacting to the light inside of you. And light and darkness is not going to mix. That's why y'all are such at war with each other. Have beef with each other constantly. If you have constantly have beef with your friends... You're not going, y'all not going to connect until that person has, until that demon devil spirit is, is, is no longer in them. But you're going to keep beefing with that person if, and, until, until that demon devil spirit come out of them. You got to understand. You got to understand. You got to.
spiritual level, physical level. You got to understand. You got the wheat and the tears. The good people and the bad people. The people that's going to suffer with Jesus Christ and the people that's going to go straight to hell. I'm going to be real with you. Being gay cannot enter the kingdom of heaven. And that's a spirit that need that that you got to go uh get off of you. Let me tell you how you can get it off of you. Surrender. Surrender and ask God for forgiveness. And I promise you you're going to have the light. If anybody wants that light, if anybody wants that light today, I suggest you do what I told you to do. Anybody. And I'm only 15 years old, y'all. And I know this. I know this. I, I know this. I understand. Because I'm not. I'm not blind. I'm not blind. I'm not blind. I'm not blind. I can see. So, recognize that. When y'all recognize that, you could get, you can get so much farther when you recognize that. You gotta recognize that. You don't recognize that? God's gonna come keep on come God's gonna continue to keep putting you through that exact same level. Through that exact same cycle. Until you break that wall. It's up to you to break that wall. I broke my wall. I broke it. I broke the wall. Whatever I did, I broke the wall. I broke it completely. And now I see the other side of them. This is why the enemy is fighting me so hard. This is why. Ain't that crazy? It's crazy, huh? Mm-hmm. Yes, ma'am. So y'all take what I said and apply it. People don't realize what they're saying. They don't know what they're saying. They don't realize what they're saying. They just talk. When you say you hate me, when you say you hate me, you're saying you hate that light inside of me. Because I have light. That's what you're saying. You're saying that you hate that light. That's what you're saying. Mm -hmm. But this is it for the video. Take what I said to y'all. Take it. And apply it. And I promise things will get easier. Break that wall. Break it. Break that wall. But I love all y'all. Thank y'all for watching this video. And I'm out.